it's nice to be in the cemetery. Um, for a long time I wanted to go up there and record like some footage to do with the abandoned school and the abandoned chapel, which is going to be a video on its own, not part of this. Uh, so I've done about 8 to 10 minutes of footage for people for you to watch. Needs editing down though. Uh, but yeah, that's going to be something you're going to see in the future. Uh, tonight, for me, I've practically got the evening to myself because my parents are going to go out because uh, to do with Bohemian Rhapsody, right? Uh, I've seen the film. Uh, my grandma's seen the film. My mum and dad haven't. So they're going out tonight to go watch it. So I'm going to do some editing. Uh, going to do some gameplay editing, do some vlogging editing and maybe make some just straight talk to camera videos and uh, yeah do what I can before I go to work tomorrow I do want to go on the bike this, this afternoon as well prior to not being too tired hopefully if I'm a bit tired I will not go out but yeah I want to go out so I'm taking the dogs out now before it gets dark they've had two walks today already one with me this morning, then one with family, etc., and this one now on my own. Uh, if I get dark, 1.8 miles off 10k. Uh, I've not had time to go on the bike really so much. So I thought I had, would do, but no, 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 I haven't. Uh, so realistically Sunday it's gonna be the next day I actually get to go on the bike perhaps maybe I don't know because tomorrow and Friday I'm doing 10-6 are my dogs gonna come or what Jesus Christ I'm walking but they're not <laughs> so and then Saturday I'm doing 7-2 so when I get home from that, if I do decide to go home or go out, uh, preferably go out, maybe, or just come back and go on the go on a bike. Uh, then Sunday, 5:11, so potentially go on the bike then. Then Monday, maybe. Okay, so maybe the next week, so Monday, I'm doing 5:11, and then. Tuesday I'm doing five, two till half nine, and I've got Wednesday and Thursday off. Then Friday I'm doing two till half nine, and then I've got Saturday and Sunday off already because it was booked off. Holly, come on! Oh my gosh, just, my dog's got stuck. Holly. Dogs, if you're going to be stupid, you'll stay on your lead. Damn, I'm getting worried. I need to stop vlogging. Because I really need to be paying attention to my dogs. Because they're just being quite naughty. Wow, that's a really nice sunset, you know. I've just seen Ben Mounsey, you know. Just look at that, it's so nice. Oh, look at him go. He's a lot fitter than I am. And she was a fell runner and I'm not. Look at that sky though. That's so nice. Oh, shucks. I'm getting out of breath from walking up here. Look at the view. Look at the sky, it's so nice. And Ben's running up here. He's mad. Well, no, he's not. He's mad. He's not mad. So heck of a lot fitter than I am. Right, hi. Hi. We're only 20 leads now. So, I've walked up that once, and I'm feeling like this. And Ben has just ran up and down it 10 times. Wow. Such a nice sky as well. Like I was thinking, oh, I was debating where to, where to walk. And uh, I ain't gonna lie, I'm glad, oh, I'm glad I chose here 
One for Sky. Well, I need to really watch where I'm going because this is the main road and it is tea time. Let me show you. So I apologise for noise because, uh, well, <coughs> it's, a, <coughs> it's very busy. Look at that. That's incredible. What such a nice sky that is. I don't have to come far to see such natural wonder. Wow, look at that, that is so nice. Oh. And then I'm gonna walk up here, and instead of like walking straight on, I'm just gonna literally turn down this way. See how much rubbish there is. I don't think I can do this with one hand. I'll give it a try though. So, let's see, uh, that there, oh, there we go, that was really awkward, that was, ow, I smashed my knee on that, right, you can't, no, right, hang on, yeah, ow, I hurt my knee, so, you can't really vlog, when you've got two dogs and try to film opening that awkward gate at the same time. Not doable. I mean, it's, well, okay. It's very, very difficult, but achievable, but still very difficult. If you're like, I don't know, not saying I've ever done it. Oh God, never mind. Nice sky though, still. <clears throat> Trying to come up with an analogy. It'd be like, I don't know, um, not that I've ever done it, but if you like try to wear stiletto heels on uh, thin ice it's possible but it's very difficult and that same situation goes to that gate up there look at that and then to this gate as well right am I gonna bang my knee again no this looks a slightly easier gate so I've got to open that and push that there we go then go up through it this is where it gets awkward because I have dogs. And there we go. Now this is where it gets awkward again. Stairs. Filming. Dogs. Steep hill. Oh my god. Uh yeah. I'm just enjoying being out whilst it's wow, wow, look at that. Look at that. Did you just see the moon coming out? Look at that for a bit. Oh my god, it's amazing. <clears throat> so, I've completed 1.8 miles of walking. I think I'm just literally going to be on the field and then go back home. Uh, yeah, it's... Uh, you can still see like the lit, how dark it is. It's getting darker. Maybe over that way, yes. But there's still like the sunset orange in the background I think if I just use my flip my camera the other way and show you which is what I'll do so you can just see ever so slightly like over that way it's like getting darker like the darker blues and like ever so slightly some more of the orange like it's going down well it's not that it's going down it's just because there's like things blocking the way and yes, it is going down because it's getting darker. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, it's nice to be on the field. I don't think there's actually anyone on the field, is there? I think there's just like some people up there just playing. But as far as I'm aware, there's like no one actually walking on this bit of field. It's quite, it's quite nice in a way. It's quite nice. Oh. At least the dogs are getting to go off. At least, right, the way of because of the way I've gone, going up the poo path bit and then going up the woodland path, they've been able to be off then. And then I've let them off again going up Mucky Lane when Ben was uh, doing his runs up and down the hill. And then to, like, come down the hill to, like, come here. So they've actually been... This is, like, the third time they've been off now 
on the same walk. <sighs> I've got to admit, I might actually walk, because I walked this, oh my god, look at that. Oh, these, I'm getting some right nice pictures here. Okay, so where was I? So I walked that way, down that way, around, and then I'm now walking this way. I might just do like a zigzag, like to walk to the end here, then walk a little bit to the right, then like drop back down to where the skips are, and then walk back up that way, and like head home. <sighs> do you know, this is really nice. Like, just, I was, I was, because I was like literally debating on like whether to go out or not, because, I was feeling a bit tired, you know, and uh, also as well, like I had, I had uh, a telephone interview this morning to do with Halfords, uh, twelve hours a week uh, to like call, call, call in. What's the word? To align. That's it. To align with my McDonald's. Now the thing is, with McDonald's, I'm a dedicated member of staff, and everyone pretty much knows that. Um, so. If I was successful with Halfords, what I would say is to drop down from full-time position at McDonald's to part-time. Because uh, then I've got two jobs then, I've never actually had two jobs in my life. Uh, I've had only just like the one at a time. Because that'd be good then, because I can manage like between two jobs. like. For example, like if my Halfords is like three days a week, or two days a week, like two six hour shifts a day, which is what I'd prefer. Uh, I'd prefer that. Uh, or like three four hour days. It depends, maybe. Uh, and then like on those days off, like pick two days where I was at McDonald's, like doing a shift. It's not just me that's filming. Well, that was nice talking to them lot who were also filming as well. And they're not doing this, they're not talking to camera like such, but they're just like looking around the surrounding area because it is looking pretty uh, nice because of how the sky looks, etc. Uh, I know some people might be like, why are you getting over excited, over excited about a sky? Sun going down and everything. Well, sometimes when it's like cloudy, and like you don't like see the sunset so much. It's just like you just see that gradual fade of it. You just see that straight fade of being in the dark. <sighs> it's nice though. Whew. Right, so we're gonna go up there, go home. Because, like I said, like the dogs I've got leads on, and they've got lights on, but I've got this on. But then again, it's not like the white, the whiteness of it will stand out quite well. Don't know how to do that. Okay, I'm gonna walk up there and go home. Okay, so I'm gonna go back that way. Uh, I, rec I recently received some Vela Forte uh, nutrition bars for biking. Uh, and yeah, they look good. Like. There's like six bars, six different flavours, and it's like for me, dad, for me, for Christmas, from me. Because <sighs> he likes his biking. I like my biking too. Might actually get some food from Halfords as well. Because they're good with biking. Okay, time to go. Get a load of that for a shit parking. He needs to slow down as well. Look at that for a shit parking. Like that's like just half assed effort, man. <laughs> I thought you'd have peed on it, Chester. God, that's such a bad parking. Oh man. Anyway, time to go home. <laughs>